Hey guys, it's Amanda. I'm back with another reaction video. I've had so many great recommendations from you guys. I've really enjoyed Peter McKay and Mickey Flanagan. They're absolutely hilarious. So I'm really looking forward to today's video, Al Murray vs. Americans. And before I get started, a lot of you mentioned that I need to react to Lee Evans. Are there any particular videos that you guys recommend as I have no idea where to start? If you do, put it in the comments. And as always, if you have any other reaction ideas, either put them in the comments or head over to my Instagram and say hello. So let's get started. You're beautiful. You're beautiful people. Have we got, have we got anyone from overseas here tonight? Anybody here from overseas? Yeah? Fabulous. From which vanquished nation do you hail, sir? Tell me. <laughs> Where from? Uh, United States. United States. Fantastic. Welcome. Eh? Welcome. I love you people. What's your name, Squire? Neil. Neil. Beautiful British name. Now, Neil. <laughs> tell me. <laughs> Neil, how, how long have you been in Great Britain, Squire? Uh, two weeks. <laughs> two weeks. Yeah, yeah. Tell me, if you had to sum up Great Britain in one word, Neil, what would it be, mate? <laughs> Come on. <laughs> Come on, Neil. <laughs> Shit will get off the pot, sir. <laughs> <laughs> you what? <laughs> Football. No. The word you're looking for, mate, is great, isn't it? <laughs> in the name for fuck's sake. <laughs> Those are yank. Now, <laughs> no, I love Americans. You're beautiful people, aren't you? Yeah? Yeah, you're beautiful people. Because the world, no, I love them. Huh? Back off. I love them. <laughs> I love them. I love Americans. Because the world needs people like Americans, don't they? Because you're dreamers, aren't you? Yeah? Yeah? You're dreamers, aren't you, Neil? Yeah? Because you've got that American dream. The American dream. Yeah? You're an American dreamer. Dreaming the American dream, aren't you, Neil? Yeah? Yeah? Now, the fact is, Neil, we don't have a dream in Great Britain. We don't. Yeah? There is no British dream. Yeah? yeah? This isn't because we lack some sort of sense of moral purpose. This isn't because we haven't got a sense of guiding destiny taking us towards a better tomorrow. No. We don't have a dream in this country, Neil, because we're awake. It's that simple. <laughs> What is that dream of yours anyway? Life, liberty, and the pursuit of happiness. Puffs. <laughs> hey. I'd be embarrassed to write that down if I were you, Scott. <laughs> it's a pleasure to have you here, you beautiful blood. <laughs> I love Americans, you're beautiful people. Yeah? You're simple folk, aren't you? <laughs> if an American can't explain something, he says he's aliens, doesn't he? <laughs> well, at least British people are prepared to admit when they're pissed, Neil. <laughs> I mean, we're sensible people in this country. This is a reasonable country. It's a reasonable size, isn't it? Great Britain isn't that big. Yeah? America's vast, isn't it? Far too big, unwieldy country. Yeah? Britain's compact. Yeah? You reasonable size. I mean, the mountains aren't exactly that big, are they? Yeah? They're big enough to learn how to climb mountains and then practice and conquer other peoples. But they're not that big in themselves. <laughs> I mean, the wildlife is not particularly wild, is it? <laughs> Squirrels are not going to hunt you down in packs, are they? <laughs> we don't have earthquakes in this country, do we? No, because we don't deserve them, is that simple? <laughs> Anyone who builds a city on a thing called the San Andreas Fault really has got it coming. <laughs> In fact, it's, it's not San Andreas's fault, is it? It's yours for building it there in the first place. <laughs> classic, classic, classic American behaviour. Trying to palm the blame off onto some poor fucking Mexican. <laughs> Forget the Alamo! Now, what is this? <laughs> We're sensible, down-to-earth people in this country. <laughs> Aren't we? Yes, Steve? Oh, we are. Here we are. Can you play God Save the Queen? Yeah? F, F, G, D, E, F, G, G, A, G, F, D, E, F, G, A, C. Now, what is this? What is this? You might have been stupid, eh? What is this? What is this? We're sensible, down-to-earth people in this country, aren't we? Hmm? This is a sensible, down-to-earth country. I mean, we never put a man on the moon, did we? No! No! What would be the fucking point? Hey? 
and yanks, you're banging about how you got there first, but no one else was trying, were they, mate? <laughs> comes first when you're on your own, is it, like, Jimmy? <laughs> it's been a year, I mean... <laughs> we're sensible people in this country, don't we? <laughs> Down-to-earth people. <laughs> yeah, 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 we never put a man on the moon. Nah, nah, the moon was never going to be part of the British Empire, was it, like, Jimmy? <laughs> <laughs> nah, nah, there's no-one to give it back to once we're done with it, was it? <laughs> No point going to the moon, putting in a railway trial by jury, parliamentary democracy. There's no bastard living there, is there? That's <laughs> the trip. There's nothing to be gained in the way of hot and spicy food <laughs> or Olympic quality athletes. It's a waste <laughs> of a journey. I mean, why would the British, the very people who invented gravity, want to go somewhere <laughs> where there isn't any? Hey! make any sense at all. Now, the moon should be left to its own business of tides, werewolves and periods. No. <laughs> if anyone can explain to me the actual difference between them last two. <laughs> Strange door later. Now the point is this. <laughs> no, just one man's silver bullet is another woman's bar of chocolate. <laughs> Period, period, Neil. That's an example of a word that means different things to you and I, isn't it? It's quite, yeah? Because you're a Yank and I'm British, yeah? 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 That's right. Period, yeah? To the American woman, the word period probably means something like full stop, doesn't it? <laughs> That's the same thing for American geezers, eh, Neil? Because hmm? <laughs> we're divided by a common language, that's right, and a fucking great big ocean, thank Christ. <laughs> the point is this. I honestly wasn't sure what to expect when I started watching this video, but he is so funny. His jokes were hilarious. His timing was so good. I'll definitely be watching more of his stuff. Although I am curious, does, is he always drinking pints in all of his stand-up? <laughs> Let me know. Um, and as I've said before, I'm having so much fun discovering British stand-up through you guys. So please keep the recommendations coming. As always, if you haven't already, please subscribe to my channel, smash that like button if that's what you're into, and I'll see you in the next video.